Welcome back to Just Because, everyone. I'm Taro Booth, and it's my mission to bring you a simplified, practical approach to beekeeping. So, uh, if you remember yesterday we were here, we set this little cell builder up. It is loaded with bees and packed. We gave them some brood. Some of it was opened with larvae and whatnot in it and, and eggs. We're going to actually today get in here and extract some royal jelly out of hopefully some cells that they've started and we're gonna do some testing tomorrow of these tools I, I told you in a previous video that we were gonna test these tools and let you know what I thought about them so we're gonna do that uh, do some grafting tomorrow but we need to get some royal jelly out to prime the the cells uh, since we're not gonna be using the Chinese grafting tool so stick around with us we're gonna go through this little guy and uh, see what we can do Thanks for watching. All right, here we go. We're going to get in here and see if we can find some cells to pull some royal jelly out of. Got a lot of bees in here. So you know, the sun is so bright behind me that I cannot even see the screen. Okay. So I'm just aiming. Looks like we've got several cells set up here. Get most of these bees off of it. I see three, four, five. There's six, but wow. there's one in that one. I think there's only one in all of those they haven't got any more than that. Yeah, would you? All right, so we're going to extract some royal jelly out of here. Bear with me a second. Pull that little larva out of there. Oh, it's huge. Yeah, it's too big. It would be too big to graft, but they started it yesterday. Okay, we got a little bit out of there. Pull down this cell wall. Let's turn this a little bit more into the sun for me. Pull that larva out of there. And that thing 
is completely packed full of royal jelly. We've, we've collected about a quarter of a cc, which will go a long ways because it only takes just a teeny tiny little bit in each cell. So we'll be back in a little bit. Then mix it up like, good. Starts to even on jumps. So we're taking the saline, or not saline, it's not saline, I apologize. It's just distilled water. We're pouring it in there to thin it so we can... Get it going and get it to go in the shrins. And we've modified this. We took the needle out so that we'll pull it up a little bit e easier. The needle that we had was just a little bit too big. This is getting a lot more out now. We're about at a, a full CC now. This is working a lot better. There you go. Nice job. All right, saline. What do you call it? It's saline. Oh, it's just, it's just like a mess. <laughs> just, yeah, distilled water. Seems like saline to me. Okay, we are back home and uh, just wanted to do a quick follow up here on the royal jelly that we collected. We actually ended up collecting about three cc's out of a half a dozen queen cells. Well, I think we'll probably collect some more today from a few in the, the hive that's trying to swarm. Um, actually really easy. Uh, this was a little tricky with the syringe. We had to break off the tip and, and make it a little bit wider for it to suck it up a little easier. However, as I went along, um, this tool right here, I think is actually even better for, for just scooping it out of the cups. This end has a much bigger scoop than this other end that you use for grafting. I'm sure that's what it was designed for, um, is just to collect your royal jelly right with this end. Worked wonderfully uh, as we were going through um, collecting the royal jelly. So I'll probably use this and not even use these syringes for the collecting of the royal jelly. I'll probably still leave uh, the oh uh, the distilled water in one of them to just kind of use to to thin 
the royal jelly down a little bit so but that's where it is so that's where we are uh, later today we'll go ahead and prime some uh, cell cups and we'll do a round of grafting we'll um, have that on here for you guys to, to take a look at so stick around uh, hopefully we'll get it done here in the next couple two or three hours thanks for watching just because for more videos that provide you with a simplified practical approach to beekeeping be sure to click that subscribe button and ring the bell notification icon so you won't miss a thing